Hi everybody, Chris Gabriel, physical therapist here at the Ortho Carolina Sports Training Center in Matthews. Today I'm going to go over three upper extremity exercises that can be helpful for baseball players, not only to improve performance, but also minimize your risk of injury. All right, upper extremity strengthening for baseball players, there's a lot of really important muscles in your rotator cuff and also in some muscles around your shoulder blade, your scapula, that are important to keep strong to minimize our injury risk. The first one I'll demonstrate today is just a prone Y exercise. You're gonna lie on your stomach, let your arm hang off the edge of the table. And what you're going to do is raise your arm up, kind of at an angle to your body, maybe around 130 degrees or so. Key things we're looking for, making sure the shoulder doesn't shrug up, and then working on your scapula, your shoulder blade to upwardly rotate. Sometimes it'll take you a little while till you can go high enough. Make sure you don't go higher to the point you have any pain or pinching in your shoulder. Another muscle that's really important for baseball players is the serratus anterior. This is a really good exercise to help learn how to activate that muscle. So a foam roll helps, or you can just slide your arms up the wall. And I tell people to put your arms and forearms on this, kind of like you're doing a plank. Feet are gonna be pretty close to the wall, but in a staggered stance. And the most important part is to push your chest away from the wall. While I maintain pressure on the foam roll, I'm gonna roll up and down in a small motion. My job is to keep my core engaged, keep my back pretty flat, and maintain that chest push back position, which is called protraction. If you had your hands on my shoulder blade, you would feel my shoulder blades rotating upward and protracting around my rib cage, and that's really what we wanna accomplish. All right, this is another really important exercise to work the muscles in the back of the shoulder and also teach your shoulder blade to posterior tilt. A lot of times during the day we sit and our shoulder blades in an anterior tilted position, but in order to throw and get that cock back, you really need the posterior tilt of your shoulder blade to maintain stability and get in a good position to throw. So basically what you can do is lean on the table, fist on the forehead, and the arm is just slightly above shoulder level, and you're gonna rotate back and forth just like this. Coaching cues are to make sure you don't fire your upper trap and get too much activation there. And remember, only go as far back as you can. A lot of people need to do some soft tissue work to loosen up their pec a little bit in order to get to that position. 